All right, everybody. We actually moved into a 99 Winnebago Flyer. Was that? Sunflyer. Sunflyer. Um, two slide outs, one big living room area and the bedroom area. Um, so far, I've only had to fix two things on it, except for I ordered a new awning because as soon as we got here to Owasso, I went to pull the awning out and it just ripped all the way down. So, got new fabric coming and should be here sometime this week. Uh, all right. So, time for the tour. Alright everybody, time for the tour. Okay, up here, we got the living room area. Couch folds into a bed. Nice. Storage underneath. Captain seat. Passenger seat. Pretty much Georgia sits there in her little car seat. And... That's pretty much that. Uh, Lions playing right now. Go Lions. We're actually winning by seven points right now. Trish and Georgia doing homeschool right now. Arts and crafts. That's awesome. Good job. Uh, in this cabinet, just laundry stuff. This one, medicine cabinet. How about if we make a Sorry, Diesel. This one, entertainment area, PlayStation 2, DVD player, um, TV changer box, I can't think of the name of it, tuner box, and over here, not much of nothing actually, VR gear, yeah, gonna have it. Georgia's school activity stuff in there. I know I picked the wrong time to do this, but it's kind of funny. Uh, Georgia's hats and other school activity stuff. Extra spare blankets for the bed out here. Uh, my wife's doTERRA stuff. If y'all want to know about doTERRA, she hosts some class online or anything. Just shoot us a message and she'll schedule a little time with you. Um, more doTERRA. This is where that goes. That is very nice. You know, uh, what's this called? Conv convection oven? Microwave? It's a convection and microwave oven. Yep. And I don't know how to use the convection. Oh. Well, we'll figure it out. Uh, this is where that goes. Okay, what else do you have Paper plates, cups, you know, stuff like that. Oh, one of these? I don't know if he's a bit not sure, honey. They might be too small. Extra vitamins. Pretty much this is George's vitamins. And lids, stuff for my lunch pail for work. Um, cups, rubber gloves, Ziploc yeah, bags. Some other stuff in there. Eventually, my wife is going to tell you about this. This is actually really good to have. I think everybody should have one. It's pretty much can take any type of water that you have and can convert it into clean drinking water. It's really good. Um, eating area, table, laptop, coffee pot, refrigerator, and freezer. much because uh, we do the ketogenic diet so if you want to know anything about that my wife can help you with that too so we got cups down here coffee cups down there uh, nuts okay. nuts nuts I stuff I can't go in everything she gets because I really don't know myself now time to go to the bedroom okay get this adjusted all right Queen size bed, but we did measure it. We can make it into a king size, you know. Uh, spare blankets for in here. My clothes and that one. Pretty much my shorts and pants for work. Um, there you go. Uh, my gaming computer. Uh, yes, I have another YouTube channel. It's called The Gaming Junkie Show, where I pretty much teach people how to set up game servers and 
videos of me playing, playing video games. All right, um, in here, extra towels, washcloths, printer paper. Um, not really used, just junk. Same for that one. All right, in here is our printer. My clothes, wife's clothes, wife's clothes. Bottom one is water heater. Okay. Uh, drawers, just computer stuff. That's it. Um, down there, my clothes, shirts, and socks. Um, like I said, that's pretty much just my pants and short shorts and overflow of stuff. Okay. Now I think it's time we go outside and show y'all everything. Now I'm going to show you the closet. My wife doesn't want me to show y'all, but I'm doing it. This is mainly my wife's and daughter's stuff. I think I got like two shirts in there. That's it. Women. I know. Women. Hi. Are you making fun of my closet that you don't have any closet space? Yeah, just tell everybody I only got like two shirts in there. <laughs> All right, and plus I got to show everybody my wife's painting. She's a good artist, ain't she? Yeah. All right, now to go outside. We'll start with the front of the RV. Got some neighbors walking. All right, we ended up buying a 1999 Sunfire. Um, I can't pronounce that word. But there's the snowball, my work car, my wife's car. This has two slide outs, like I said, um, nice tires, uh, and this compartment is the stroller, fishing gear, wagon, uh, this is where the water hose, power lines and everything goes, uh, that's the water, water and sewer hookup, that's the generator, and the thing about this, we, this came with a 30 amp, but Mark, the one of the owners at Fuller's Resort, actually converted it back to a 50 amp for us. So now everything in our RV actually works. And I'm going to show you all the rear. Backup camera. I got a dog pan. I got some stuff to clean up. Bedroom slide out. And that's the second view. This is the other side. All right, I got all my tools and everything in there. Uh, this has a bunch of bungee cords, ladder, and miscellaneous stuff. That has a radio in it. The grill and outdoor candles and everything. And you're wondering why is my awning on the ground? Well, when I first got here, I started pulling out this side actually got stuck and it actually caused it to completely rip so i have another one on order it's supposed to be here this week so and i'll do a video on how to replace your awning because supposedly it takes like two hours and plus you know that broken supposedly it's already at my sister-in-law's house so other than that that's it oh yeah and plus we gotta the seal is not good on them so I've contacted an RV place. They're supposedly going to be sending somebody out next week to get that fixed. So let's go back in. Hi, Daddy. Oh, hey, Georgia. You enjoying school time? Yeah. Yeah. All right, everybody. That's pretty much our RV. Uh, now it's home. So. So we're going to make something fun. Oh, I thought she was talking to me, but she's not. So, all right. If any questions, uh, leave them down below. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe and give us a thumbs up. And if you're expecting people on this channel to be traveling all the time, hate to disappoint you. But the only traveling will be is from uh, job site to job site. I'll also throw in some videos of me actually doing what I do. And if, if I didn't tell you before, I'm actually a heavy equipment operator. My wife, Trish, right there, yep, her, actually teaches people on how to use essential oils through doTERRA. So like I said, if you want to know about that or if you want to know about what I do, just comment below. All right, bye.